Why am I doing that? How long have I been working on this mirror? How long have I been working on these mirrors? I don't know. About an hour probably? An hour? We've been working on them since this morning, sir. It's already 1 o'clock. Oh, wow. Mirrors. We've been working on mirrors since this morning. I'm peeling the paint off, okay? Welcome to DIY Automotive School with my friend Pete and Minnie the Body Shop Girl. It's everything you need to know about cars and more. Alright, what we got here. Uh, we were in the process of painting our mirrors, okay, and the paint started reacting. So the first thing that we did is... So the first thing that we did is we went ahead and stopped immediately, wet sanded the paint down where it was reacting, and we went ahead and put sealer on it. Now, sealer, most of the time, cures, okay, the problem, most of the time. But not this time. Okay, if Swampy can give me the other mirror. Yeah. This is called chemical reaction. If you can see right there, you can see that, okay. When that happens, you need to stop immediately. Stop what you're doing immediately and let it dry thoroughly. Now, we do have a problem with this one. As you can see, the paint is coming right off, okay? The mirrors that I purchased for this car are supposed to be paint ready. Uh, they're supposed to already have primer on them. And all you're supposed to do is sand them down with uh, 320 dry and paint them. But that ain't the way it is here. Because everything we've done to this 41 wheelies has been three or four times. So, if you look right here, okay, you can see, just by barely touching it, you can see where the paint didn't stick to the paint, to the piece. So once that starts happening, then you have the reaction, it all starts peeling off, no matter what you do. So now, what I gotta do is I gotta scrape, okay, there's the plastic that was supposed to be paint ready, okay. So now I gotta scrape this all off, I gotta get all this paint off, here's the other spot right here, Okay, if you look right there, you can see it. Okay, now watch close here. Okay. So what I got to do is now I got to get all this paint off. Just like you see. I'm barely scraping on it and the paint is just falling off. Okay, and you can see that the plastic is shiny. It's supposed to have primer on it and ready to paint, but it's not. So that's I'm $140. Dump that down with 80 because I got to get all that off. Wow. And then, on top of all that, then I got to uh, reprime it with some primer. And then we won't be able to paint it until tomorrow. So this is a good example of don't follow directions 100% thoroughly. Or you might have the luck that my friend Pete has. You know what my luck is? Ain't worth a crap. How y'all doing? We're still working on our mirrors. We're still on the mirrors. 45 minutes later now, these little pieces here, these are our brackets. Okay, I've taken them off the mirror housing. And uh, what we're gonna do with those, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get that lined up. There. We're gonna use stripper on these. Try to get that paint off, because these here are. So we'll go ahead and get that off. There we go, just like that, so it doesn't leak out. Get this one up here. Get those ones up. We'll go ahead and strip the paint off those with airplane stripper, because those are metal. And uh, so we'll take the stripper and we'll just dab it on there easily. As you can see, it's coming off very, very quick. And uh, 
We don't want to use this on our plastic because it will melt the plastic. The only way to strip that paint off, this is stripper, bud. This is this will eat you like acid, sir. Do not touch it. So always uh, make sure you pay attention to plastic parts and don't believe everything you read. These were supposed to be primer. They were supposed to be ready to paint, and they're not. Okay, uh, we've waited about 15, 20 minutes on our little pieces here. So we'll go ahead and strip those down with some steel wool. This is a mess. Look at this swampy. This is a freaking mess, dude. Mess ain't even the word for this. This is just pure bullshit. Yeah, sure. Paint ready my ass, bud. Strip to bare metal. Wow. Took all the paintable primer off. Swampy. Now the final step on our mirrors is sanding them down to 180, which we've already done. And uh, now we're ready to put the 2K primer on. 2K primer is the only primer you're going to be able to use on this plastic. That's it. That's, that's it. Uh, I've been working on these since what? Not 8 o'clock this morning. It's now what? 2 o'clock? Wow. What a wasted fucking day, Swampy. Wasted! Do you think I can charge it? Okay, we went ahead and put the mirrors in primer. So what do we gotta do next? You gotta, you gotta paint them tomorrow. We gotta wait till tomorrow to sand them. We can't sand them now. I know you are telling me What am I doing here? Spray paint. What am I gonna do with this? Spray paint. Why? I don't know. I'm gonna put a guide coat on them, sir. Okay, if you look at our mirrors, this is plastic. These are the plastic mirrors that messed up on us. You can see that they're painted and done. I got four full wets of coat on it. You can see the shine that uh, has been put on it. You can see how it has laid down very nicely, okay? And that is because we wet sanded it with 400 and a block. We did not use our fingers. If you look at the, okay, you can see the sheen is very, very nice. And uh, got our stands painted. So remember, when you're painting plastic pieces such as these, it's always important to remember not to believe everything that the manufacturer says. This is actually a tri-stage color. This is a uh, candy apple yellow, which is a Lamborghini color, okay? And it's a very, very nice color, and we had to paint the mirrors to match, so that was a big job. This is Pete, my friend Pete. Everybody's friend, Pete, saying goodbye. I hope this has helped you out. Uh, tech tips, helpful hints, and secrets of the trade is what everybody is trying to learn in life. And learning in life is what it's all about. Learning in life is going to make you a better person. Take it easy. We'll see you later. I don't see you looking at the clock, sir. We got to go. Don't look at the camera. Don't look at the camera, sir. Don't talk. Don't talk. Don't talk. Don't talk. Don't talk. You're in serious trouble today. You're in serious trouble because you disrespect people and you play your little manipulation games, sir. It's over. No, I don't. Don't touch my clock, please. Don't do it. That's my clock, not yours. Yeah, my school starts back up, so I don't have to be here. Thanks for watching DIY Automotive School. Classes don't stop till you know everything.